Hey everyone, it's Raphael from XX Raphael Productions, and I'm going to show you how to add in some overlays in the Movavi video editor. So, for this, I am using the 2022 version, as you can see here. So, to get started, let's go ahead and import all the necessary files we need for our video project. So, I'm going to go ahead and drag in, oops, I'm sorry, drag in these three right here into the import box. And then here I'm going to show you what I'll be using. So first I have my main clip, that's the main video. And then I have my overlay, which I will demonstrate, all right? So the first thing we are going to do is drag in your main video clip, all right? So in the timeline, I'm going to drag it right here. And then for adding in the overlay, we're going to go ahead and create an extra one. So I'm going to go ahead and click the plus um, symbol over here. And we can add in an extra video track, so select that. And then, with this extra um, video track, that is when we add in our overlay. So, now that we've got the main clip in, drag in your overlay clip, alright? So, I'm going to go ahead and drag it right here. And now, as you can see, um, it is quite hard to see, so I'm going to go ahead and edit my scale. And as you can see over here, we can now easily see in the timeline, all right? So this is the one that we'll be editing. It's simply a video of me playing Minecraft. I'm going to um, show you. So that's simply the Minecraft over here. And now make sure you select overlay on the very left. So click the very last um, selection and select overlay. And then here is where we um, are going to select picture in picture. Now there are a whole bunch of other things you can pick, but in my case specifically I'm doing picture in picture and now here we can actually resize and move the image or not the image the video clip around alright so let's move we can make it bigger we can make it even smaller in my case I think this size should be perfect alright so if you're editing this it might be a bit laggy for the first few seconds don't worry it will fix itself in a few seconds alright as you can see over here it is doing all a bunch of background tasks so it'll be a bit slow for the first few seconds and it should fix itself later all right so I'm gonna click play right now and you can see that um, the video clip is working as intended I'm playing Minecraft and then I have my main video clip which is simply bubbles or you can say white circles um, around all right so if I want to edit this overlay I can just click on this so it's highlighted yellow and then select this over here which is called clip properties alright and now here you can see we can also put the volume down if I want it to be like zero percent because I don't want any sound coming from the overlay and then I can also edit my speed I think my speed is perfect I don't have to edit anything but obviously your mileage might vary and then we also have the opacity setting this slider here which I can also let's go and make it 28 almost sorry, 25 percent I can actually make the video clip see through so you can see that um it is a bit faded that's because I adjusted my opacity right here all right so that's a whole bunch of cool stuff you can do you can even make it fade in or fade out if you want to but let's go ahead and delete this now so I'm gonna go ahead and delete this um and I'm gonna go ahead and go back to my original um that's my import where I imported my files and now I'm gonna now demonstrate with the image so this is a screenshot, as you can see, it's a .png file. I'm going to go ahead and drag that into my video um, timeline. So here, an advantage of using this is because um, since it's a picture, you can resize, well, okay, I'm sorry, you can make it longer or shorter as long as you want to, compared to a video clip where it has a fixed amount of length, all right? So here we can do the same thing. We can go to overlay and we can do picture and picture and then we can do the exact same things that we did with the other one. And if you want to edit, we can simply go over here and change in the settings. All right. So that is simply how you add in some video overlays in the Movavi video editor. Thank you very much for watching. And I hope it helped you out. If you have any extra questions, just comment down below. Um, but this is simply for the 2022 version. So Perhaps if you're watching this sometime in the future, some things might be different and I can make an updated video in the future. So hopefully this video did help you out. However, Raphael out and I will see you in my next video. So see you soon.